Hey everyone, so adding or odd numbers is a one of the concept in a square and square root. It's interesting a uh, uh, way like uh, what happens if you're adding a first n odd numbers and let us see the pattern over here. So if I add the first odd number that is a one, so one is equal to one square we can write which is again equal to one, right? Now let us let me add a next odd number. So after one we have three. So 1 plus 3 is equal to 4 and we know that 4 is equal to 2 square, right? Okay, I'll just do a small change here. I'll write uh, 1 is equal to 1 and that is equal to 1 square. Now, I'm going to add next odd number. So 1 plus 3 plus 5 is equal to 9 and 9 is equal to 3 square. So one, once again, let us see one more pattern. 1 plus 3 plus 5 plus next odd number is 7 is equal to. So if I add all of this, I'll get 16 and 16 is equal to 4 square. So what I have observed from this pattern, if you observe here, when I'm adding a 1 odd number, I got 1 square. If I'm adding a 2 odd numbers, I'm adding a 2 square. If I'm adding a three odd numbers, remember the odd numbers are first three odd numbers or first two odd numbers, and I'm getting three square, which is nine. So um, if I'm adding one, two, three, and four odd numbers, that's a four square, which is 16. So you don't have to just add up, just find how many odd numbers you're adding and then square off it. That's it. So likewise, if I keep on going, let me suppose add a, a one plus 3 plus 5 plus 7 plus 9 plus 11 suppose okay or let me add 13 also so instead of adding what i can do i'm gonna just count how many odd numbers i'm adding so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and this will be equal to 7 square which is 49 so this is a one of the small trick uh, on this chapter square and square root. I hope it's clear. Thank you so much for watching.